What's up everyone? Liam here back from Rebel Retics and I hope you all had a lovely festive season. Um, I sure enjoyed mine. Um, today is quite a special day. We have an unboxing of a new snake over here. Also reticulated python. I'm all into retics. The funny thing about this is she's a mystery. Um, she has Jampaya blood in her, she has Saluisi blood in her and I talked to a lot of breeders and a lot of people told me from other countries, uh, not from South Africa, told me that they think she has Borneo blood in her because she has a lot of the characteristics like colouring and things that Borneo retics also have. So she's a mystery, hopefully along the way in the future we'll be able to see exactly what genes she carries. Um, yeah, uh, we're gonna hope for the best. So I got her from a guy from PE, the same guy that I got Rosaline from, um, JP, and yeah, thanks dude. So we're gonna unbox her now and then I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, let's open her up. My camera man is a bit shit scared of snakes, so I'll take the phone now. Let's hope she's chilled. Okay, so let's take a look. Yeah, it comes out. Oh man, this is a beautiful snake. There you go. Damn. Just look at this coloring. She is said to be around three meters. We'll see now. Just look at this white. I've never seen a retic like this before. And she's a pretty snake. And as I said, she has, she definitely has Saluisi blood in her. And then they said it was Jampaya as well. And like I said, a lot of breeders tell me she might be Borneo. Um, let's look at this battery. Man, she's beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna do my camera, man. The camera back and then pick her up. She is quite big. As I said, she's about three meters. She's just a beautiful snake. She almost has a purple, a dark, purple grey colour to her. I'm not sure if you can catch it on camera but in person. You can see over here. Oh, this is about how long she is. She's a beautiful snake. Okay you can reverse out and I'll take it to the sun. I'll show you that in the distance. She's gorgeous. So yeah, she's gonna have some pretty cool babies. I mean, she has no, a normal retic usually has a lot of brown in. Um, of the ones that I've seen. You can see she has no brown. I'm not sure if you can get it on camera, but she's completely gray, dark gray. She almost has a purple tone to her over here. And then with the black, Rosettes and rosettes, rosettes, I'm not sure exactly what you call it, and then the dominant white lines, almost like a tiger's lines. These white, this white, like white, white, it's beautiful. And then I love the patterning from here, almost has like a marble look to it over here. She is beautiful. I'm really happy with this snake. And she's about two, two and a half to three years old. Um, 
Lengthwise, we'll, I'll measure and let you guys know what she is. I think she's about... Weight, weight wise, not at all. Not ready to breed. Um, age wise, still needs to go about a year or so. But I would say she is about... Let's see. 1.5. She's over there. Um, yeah, I'd say... Maybe just under three meters. Three meters if I'm lucky. I'm one, 1.8. And she goes up around my shoulders. Yeah, let's say, I think she's 2.8. Um, at two and a half years old. Yeah, about 2.8. I'm 1.8. Yeah, well, I'll measure and let you guys know. But as you can see, this is my newest edition, and she still needs a name, so if you have any cool ideas, you can drop it in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Tiger. She's gonna... Tigerine. <laughs> nah. Um, she's... <laughs> Funny guy. <laughs> uh, yeah, she still needs a name, and then I'm gonna feed her now. <laughs> and yeah, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe um, for future videos. And yeah, she needs a name, so leave it in the comment section below. I'm just gonna give you one more look. It's a beautiful snake. She's not something special like a golden child or a tiger or anything. This is, as I said, she's a mystery. So yeah, thanks guys.